just moves through you and comes out your hands and into the work. It's beautiful. Art is worship. Absolutely. Oh yeah. Sure. I think any kind of creative expression, because God made us to be creative beings, that we should be using every kind of creativity that we can. Oh absolutely. Art is art well for me dance and dance is an art it's a whole body experience um, so the expression of um, you know just expressing yourself with every limb and every it, it to me it's the it's such an awesome form of worship and um, it could artistic it's all giving yourself um, over to an expressive form so for me yes it, I think it's very very much a part of worship I know it does for some people, and I think it's I think it's really good for children. And uh, for me, I, I don't know that I make that connection, but I've never been exposed to it either. So I shouldn't say that because I don't know. I mean, I've never personally had that in my worship. Absolutely, uh, art is uh, you walk outside. Art's everywhere. Um, you know, it's in the skies and the trees. Uh, you know, uh, of course I'm an artist, so I'm going to say that. <laughs> Depending on what kind of art, I'm, I've been involved with drama, and um, I put on many plays, and I, when I was playing a specific part, it was worship to me. So I think that if any, any kind of art, whether it be music, whether it be drama, whether it be a painting, if it helps someone to get closer to the Lord, why not? I think it's helpful. Yes, art has a place in worship. Art has many places in worship. Um, absolutely. And there's different forms of art. You know, obviously there's, there's you know, painting, drawing, sculpture, photography, um, videography. There's so many different forms of art. Um, and I believe that God has given us talents, and to squelch those talents will be crime. I think that we need to um, use what we're given and use it for the glory of God. Again, not for ourselves and not to glorify ourselves, but to give glory to God. And so I think if we can, we can worship Him through a painting or, um, you know, or a sculpture or in pictures. Um, I think God speaks to us through color and through images and through. Um, it, 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 he can, he, his spirit can flow through us, and so I firmly believe that that he can almost direct, as he, he can direct our movements and our voice. I think he can direct our images, whatever that is, with heart. Um, absolutely, I think people express themselves in different ways. While um, I'm not an artist in, in terms of painting or sculpture, things like that. Um, it more for me would be a, a musical expression, but art certainly has its place for certain people. Definitely. Art is another all-encompassing thing if you think about it. Um, art. Um, the, the beautiful landscape of the, of the mountains, the, um, that people paint. I guess you can think about everything that people paint. Um, and that's everything. Um, it could be still life, a bowl, uh, a picture. It could be uh, birds flying in the air. It's, um, it's pretty amazing. Um, I, I think art is, again, it's uh, art's about expressing yourself um, and using creativity. And uh, since we have a creative God, uh, known as a creator, as the first things that we know about him is that he creates new things and that we're made in his image. Um, I think that uh, part of what's knit inside of us in the image of God is a creative element. And um, art is a lot about expressing that creative element um, in different ways. So uh, I think that creativity isn't just coming out to um, express um, earthly things, but that creativity needs to come out to 
um, express the, the heavenly aspects of things as well.